Captain Jack, part of the Words of Steel team, and this is The Dancer. I wish to bring to light the life of Samuel Sharp, a man whose thoughts and actions were lit candles in the dark. He was born a Sagittarius, according to the stars, and was very much a centaur in the sense he saw in halves. His world was black and white. Wrong and right were separate paths, but what I want to emphasise were the colours in his craft. Sam was a dancer, remarkable, a master of the art, and every pirouette he stretched would mend another scar. You see, at school, Sam had a hard time. Despite being so bright, he was haunted by a memory that woke him every night. In his infant years, Sam had borne witness to a sight that was so grotesque and violent, in its silence, noise went white. It had imprinted in his mind a single grayscale image, those blood-black walls, the kitchen stool, and that breathless body in it. Sam stood shivering. His neighbours phoned the police once they were with him. His role model was a murderer, and his origin the victim. Now, suffice it to say that society was livid. With no option but adoption, Sam was bound to be a cynic, but to everyone's surprise, they found him proud to still be living. He grew up an optimist, an honest kid whose duty was a self-driven incentive to embed the world in beauty. It was moving to all those that were privy to his growth, how his stoicism flowed like rivers running through the mulch, how he acted unabashed at living in a brand new home, how his attitude was compassionate, how his talents had evolved. Sam went from weekend classes, met with laughter by his judging peers, to the Royal Ballet Academy, and an illustrious career. His name appeared in lights. And his fame was retribution for those dim-witted critics who'd belittled and abused him. Through this medium of art, Sam had departed his confusion. But despite success and pride, he would never find his restitution. See, the truth is that although all his audiences adored him, that though they knew his name and even though they knew his story, they could never know his pain. It was only ever a show to them. In the end, how could they? So Sam danced for their catharsis, and he danced to entertain. Sam danced a thousand dances, but he danced them all in vain.